Welcome to the Department of Industrial Engineering and Management Systems at the University of Central Florida. It's very clear our mission is to produce the best and top industrial engineering leaders that will design the future in, the, in this global economy. Basically, an industrial engineer designs, control, and improves systems and processes. And there are some very important areas, such as mathematical modeling, data analytics, of that they, there are many jobs in that area. Also, you will see an industrial engineer as a director of a factory, a production system. They will be designing process design and control, facility design, the architect and the civil engineer constructs the building, however, the layout inside in order to produce the, be the best flows that is designed by an IE. We have the human interface to electronic devices such as the iPhone, the Samsung 23, all of that is designed by an industrial engineer. Logistics and supply chain is also industrial engineers designing all the distribution centers of Walmart, Target, that type of companies. And a very important area is cost analysis. These engineers, industrial engineers, they know about money. In summary, the industrial engineers know about systems integration. Whenever you have a team of engineers, a computer scientist, you have a mechanical, you have an electrical, in the middle of them coordinating all the different tasks, we will have an IE doing that. They have more emphasis on human interaction. And of course, as we said before, they have a more business orientation than the other engineering disciplines. Where do we find systems and processes? In many types of companies, and also in those companies, we will find UCF industrial engineers graduated from our program, our alumni, and our students also they have internships in these companies, such as Walt Disney, uh, in healthcare, Advent Health, in FedEx, in Google, in the defense industry, such as Lockheed Martin, Boeing, in manufacturing companies, such as Toyota and Tesla. Therefore, you can find our alumni in these companies and also many of our students, they found internships in these companies. Code of the day. However, if a chemical engineer designs assistance, it will be chemically efficient. If a mechanical engineer designs assistance, it will be mechanically efficient. However, if an industrial engineer designs assistance, it will make a profit. And there are so famous industrial engineers, as we said. Industrial engineers are the ones that they have the highest probability to be the chairman or the chief executive offers, officers of companies. And they can be from for banks, they can be from manufacturing companies, uh, high-tech companies, they are all over the place. We have our astronaut. We are one of the departments that they have an astronaut as an alumni, uh, Nicole Stott. In addition, let's talk a little bit more about our program. We have around 400 to 500 students, and we have been growing in the last 10 years. And now we are number nine in the nation. We have a very interesting BS to MS program where the student can complete the master's degree and the BS in just five years. 40% of our current students are women and 70 to 80% of the students they have had or, or they have an internship 
at the senior level. And we do senior design with real world senior design uh, marquee companies. And all of these projects are sponsored by industrial partners. 40% of our projects are multidisciplinary. We do, we do those projects with mechanical engineering, computer science, and electrical engineer. In a survey in 2019, six months after graduation, 97.5% of our students, they had a job or they were enrolled in graduate school. In senior design, we have amazing projects with local industry and regional industry and US industry. Those projects are amazing and our students usually they get good prices in the college because of those projects and companies. The organizations that they sponsor these projects are very happy with the students and their teams and achievements. In addition, there are research opportunities for undergrads. In average, 20% of our undergrad students, they publish a paper in an international or regional conference in research. Therefore, there are many, there are plenty of opportunities in, in the different I areas. One of these interesting research ideas and projects is the one by Dr. Ivan Galibay called Social Scene. It's sponsored by a Defense Advanced Research Project Agency, DARPA, that one that um, sponsored the internet 30, 40, 50 years ago. And this is a, a project where they are simulating social media, the internet, and the different outlets of social media, such as Twitter. And they are trying to understand better the interactions. And in the future to avoid people with fake news and classify things like sarcasm uh, uh, in social media and certain other things. Therefore, there are plenty of opportunities and the, our faculty have great projects. If you are a great student, that means you have very good academic progress. In addition, you contribute to the, our society here and you have, have demonstrated some leadership capabilities you can apply to the order of Pegasus. In UCF, 10,000 students, at least every year, are able to apply to the Order of Pegasus, but only 10 to 20 students are able to get it. It's very hard because as I said, you have to be excellent in your academic progress, but also you need to be a contributor to society and you have demonstrated leadership in the university. Our department have had several students in the last years achieving this prestigious award. One of them is Tatiana Vieco, that she's a leader in sustainability, and Rana Riyadh, that have been working for several companies at the top level. Of course, when you come here, you can exercise your leadership and continue education with student organizations such as ASQ, the American Society of Quality, the Sales Engineering Society, the Institute of Industrial and Systems Engineers, CHEP, NASB, Eli Square to enhance leadership. Summary, excellent IE job opportunities. Our starting salaries are in the range of 64,000 to 96,000, even beyond that. Our department and the university has a strong reputation with employers and our ranking is always growing. Plentiful of internships all over, not only local, but regional and at the US level too. There is a great report 
among faculty and students. Students, they meet frequently with faculty and faculties open to them. And of course, I is a rewarding profession with plenty of opportunities all over many different types of industries. Thank you, Dr. Abello. I'm Mansuri Molagasami, and I'm the graduate director for the Department of Industrial Engineering. I wanted to share one more reason as to why you should come to the industrial engineering program at UCF. We have four outstanding options for you to continue on once you graduate. Uh, the first one is the Master of Science in Industrial Engineering. That's generally for people who choose to continue on and they want to get more foundational knowledge in the field of industrial engineering. Uh, the next one, Master of Science, we're a, a very popular science and a degree, industrial engineering in general, for people other than engineers. For example, physics majors, chemistry majors, or um, you know, statistics, math, uh, they may um, want to continue on and, and do something different or augment their knowledge in um, engineering. So this was designed for them. You would have to have calculus one, cal calculus two, probability and statistics and a programming language. And of course, have the minimum required uh, GPA and all that. And you could continue on and um, you know, get an MS degree if you don't come from engineering. The other really popular degree that we offer, this is one of our largest programs, is the Master of Science in Engineering Management. And this is for people who've worked for three to five years as engineers and they're moving up in the ranks and they want to have the knowledge and the expertise in engineering management to be able to uh, go up the ladder. And then finally, one of our fastest growing degrees is system, Master of Science in Systems Engineering. This is a fairly new program. Our first class started in 2020, and it, the numbers are really exploding because of what goes on in the industry and the needs of the industry. Um, the, we were just ranked last year as the best online master's program in engineering management by onlinemastersdegrees.org. We're number 37 in the US News and World Report this year. We have a fairly large graduate program when you compare us to other IE programs around the nation. We've got out of over 100 PhD students and more than 350 master's students. Uh, like Dr. Ravello said, we are very uh, hands-on, We, you know, because we the numbers aren't huge. We know our students. Personally, uh, our faculty are, and staff are outstanding uh, teachers and they very student oriented. And there are some opportunities for master's degree students. Um, if, for example, you have some skills to offer uh, in terms of programming, data analytics, um, so, you know, even though the first dibs go to PhD students, but masters still have an opportunity to get funding. If you have additional questions after today, please contact me um, and Christine Saro. Uh, she's the undergraduate academic advisor and she will be answering your questions, such as uh, transfer of credit from IAP and other situations that you have. Thank you. <laughs>